channel, guys. It's your girl, Coco Styles. And on this channel, we talk about beauty, fashion, lifestyle, and styling. Girls, I wanted to come to you today with my monthly empties. I haven't done one of these, I don't think, on YouTube. But as I was replenishing my products for my face and my body, I thought I'd share some things that I have worn out and completely emptied, okay? And these items are affordable. Um, I have some things that are for the face and I have some things that are for the body. Not a ton of things, but I usually don't try a bunch of new products. Some of them are new, but when I tell you I emptied out the clip, <laughs> they're empty. So let's get into the first item. When it comes to skincare, I don't really like to try a bunch of stuff on my face, but this item here, this is the Dermalogica, and I've shown you guys this before, pre-cleanse. This is probably the first month where I literally finished it in a month. Like, and this is a big bottle. I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say a month and a half because I did have it a little bit longer. Um, because I did try a new product as far as like pre-cleansing, but this is empty now. If you do not have a pre-cleansing product, you are missing out and missing a step for your skincare routine. Most women will use like a cleanser to get the makeup off and stuff, but with this, rub it in around your eyes, make sure you don't get it in your eyes, of course, and it's gonna lift up any mascara that's sitting, anything you have on your eyebrows, definitely around the eyelash area, it lifts every single thing that's on your eyes. Foundation that's left over. Now, there's a couple of ways you could actually apply this. Some people just apply it to their skin with the makeup on. I don't do that. I still like to use my cleansing water first to remove the majority of the makeup and then I'll go ahead and use this as my pre-cleanse. And then of course you guys know I love my Neutrogena. But this is emptied out completely for this month and I love it. Dermalogica pre-cleanse, I wanna say it's about 40 bucks maybe? Maybe a little bit more. Maybe a little bit more, but what I like to do is if I'm getting close to the end, I always pick up another one so I don't feel like that I'm buying a whole bunch of products at one time because it does add up. But this is item number one, the Dermalogica Pre-Cleanse. Also, if you are a girl who likes to shave, I don't know what they call it, when they shave like the little hairs off the face, this is actually good to use as well because you should always have something that's oily, oil based in rubbing that razor across your face. So if you haven't tried it and you wanna try it, use this as your base to kind of shave off any type of little peach fuzz that you have on your face. The second item is this Confidence in Cream. Listen, this is like, this is done. Done, done, done. <laughs> The confidence in cream. Now, I did buy a replacement for this, but not this. They didn't have any more. So I bought another moisturizer. I'll show you guys that in another video as new products for my skin. And I actually really, really like it. Um, but this is the confidence in cream product here. <sighs> now, I was a little skeptical at first about this because I am a Neutrogena girl. I don't need to buy every expensive facial product. I just don't. But this, I absolutely love. So I was using this in the daytime, and then I was using my other moisturizer at nighttime, or I would just like swap here and there between, oh, uh, go between the two. But the Confidence in Cream, I've shared this before, is my go-to, go-to, go-to. I'm gonna go get another one today because I am out, but even though I do have another moisturizer, I do like this one as well. So that's the second item. So those two items are from my face. And the third item that is also from my face is going to be the Tatcha Dewy Skin Cream. This is going too, guys. It's going. <laughs> it's going. Now, I had a sample of this. And when I tell you, the sample is what got me to get this, okay? It is gone like gone. I'm gonna replace it because I like it a lot. Actually, if I don't replace it, it's okay because I have the other moisturizers. Um, but for definitely for the warmer months, 
this is it. I hope they do not discontinue it because it was really working well when it was super hot here in Atlanta. I didn't need to put a ton on my face and I felt super moisturized with this. Not oily, just moisturized. You guys know it's a huge difference. Um, but this is another empty for the month. And if you haven't tried it out, I would say give it a try. If you like your skin to look dewy, this is your go-to girl. <laughs> so those are the three items for the face. So Tatcha Dewy Skin Cream is another item that is my fave and that I emptied out for this month. The last item for the face is going to be the La Roche-Posay uh, SPF. You can get this from Sephora or you can get this from Ulta. I was a little skeptical about using certain SPFs from certain designers, designers, from certain brands, um, because I didn't know if they were good for like a darker skin person or just people of color in general. A lot of the girls were using the black girl sunscreen, but then people were saying that it was like a white cast. So I did a ton of research on this, and this is the one, guys. So this is another empty for me this month. And this one has <laughs> SPF 50. So I think that's enough for like your daily use. Um, anything higher than that, I don't think you need every day. Unless you're probably in like, I don't know, maybe Vegas or something. But I do think this is enough for like your daily SPF dose for a woman of color. So that's all of the items for the face. The other two items are going to be for the body. Now, if you know me, and I've said this before, I like to smell good when I'm going to sleep, okay? So, perfume is something that I do wear at night. I don't like to put on a lotion that has like a perfume smell because it usually has like a bunch of stuff that I really don't want on my body. But perfume, I would say yes. It doesn't have to be something super expensive. It could be something that's affordable, something that has a nice, fresh scent, something light, something that is not gonna like mess with your nose when you're sleeping. And it's this. It's the Daisy Love Mark Jacob. Very affordable, guys. This flower on top. Um, <laughs> very cute scene. <laughs> but I love this for night. It just has a nice scent, not overpowering for nighttime. Um, I don't think, like, I think if you had like a husband or whatever, or if you were laying in a bed with someone, I don't think it would bother their nose because it's a nice light scent. So a nighttime fragrance is important for me. And I'm gonna replace this because I really, really like this one. It's affordable and it's a cute little bottle and I like to wear it to sleep. So that's one item that I emptied out a month and a half on this one. Yeah, I would say like a month and a half. I could push it to two, but I'm gonna say a month and a half. No, I'm, I'm probably, it's probably a little bit over that. But it's empty now, but this is something that I wear every single night. Oh, so, yeah. And the last item is the OC um, body oil. This body oil is empty. Okay. This was an empty. I emptied this out really, really quick. And it's because I probably was putting a whole bunch. I'm a big girl. Tall girl, long arms, long, long legs. I am lathering my body with this stuff. Will I buy it again? Probably not, only because I went through it so fast and it's not cheap. Oh, I'm probably gonna try to figure out another oil that has like good products in it or something that I could actually make myself. I'll probably do that. But this is the Mineralized Moisture Glow Oil. It is cruelty free, vegan, gluten free, um, the bottle is really nice, so again, if you are using this and that confidence in cream, you can definitely put something else in it and utilize the bottle again. Like I said, it's expensive, so you might as well get your cost out of it. Um, but those are my empties for the month. I wanted to share them with you guys. I haven't done a bunch of beauty videos in a second. And if you're looking for any new products, definitely give these a try. The only one I would say you don't really need is this oil, <laughs> but I like it. It smells good, it's it's nice, it's a nice smell. I tried it, I emptied it out. I may try it again, buy it again, but if not, I'm okay with it because I do have other moisturizers and I have other oils that I like. Um, but those are the items that I emptied out this month and I wanted to share them with you girls. So comment below if you have a favorite product that you purchased this month at the beginning and you totally 
ran through it. <laughs> I'm interested to know. So thank you guys for tuning into this video. If you stay to the end of this video, please comment Coco We See You. And guys, don't forget to follow me on Instagram at Coco Styles NYC and Coco Styles NY and my personal style blog, Coco Styles NYC and my style services, Coco Styles NY.com. And I'm on tickety tickety talk, Coco Styles NYC. And I will catch you guys in the next one. Bye guys.